Ah, uh, it's Pedophile! But we are back with Paper Mario and the Origami King. Previously, I believe, if I remember correctly, we took care of the streamer that was yellow? I think it was the yellow streamer we took care of. And then we told Olivia, hey, let's go out to Toad Town. But then I was like, no, let's go look for Max Hearts instead. And then I got horribly lost trying to find my way to the woods. So, uh, hopefully we don't get quite as lost again. But, uh, today we are going to go through, and let me just swap to that. There we go. Today we're going to continue on with the main adventure. I figured, why not save all the backtracking for the very end next time? Unless I'm, like, desperately in need of hearts. Because I think according to this guy, there's, like, only two remaining. Let me just, uh, not two remaining, but two currently available. Yep. Uh, dare to the... Yep. All right, one is the ninja course. A Shogun mystery must be solved. The House of Riddles is involved. That one is, I'm pretty sure, collect all the ninjas. I'll get a guide once we're, you know, able to do that. And then, Temple of the Fickle Fates again. Yes. This one. In Temple Luins lies a crypt. A heart outside and in is kept. A heart outside and in is kept. Oh! That sounds like there's two pieces of a heart to collect. All right. I don't know what I'm to do. Perhaps one day we'll meet a new, and on that day you might just find another hint to blow your mind. All right, I'll keep that in mind for later. Oh, please. Because I believe up next, the dock. You're on it. Ah, oh, there's something like a fresh ocean breeze. I need a boat. Captain! Shall we set motor for the great sea? Yes. Because, because originally when we came out here, we uh, had Bobby. Rest in peace, Bobby. And we saw a streamer, but we really didn't want to go after it. Here we are, the Great Sea. Wow, the Great Sea is so big. This breeze feels so good. Why does it smell so salty? It's the ocean. It's so endlessly big. The only word you could use to describe it is epic. Well, that and great, I guess. Oh, look, there's the purple streamer. What's it doing way out here on the Great Sea? Looks like it stretches out really far. The Great Sea is huge. We'd better stick close to the streamer so we don't lose track of it. Olivia's first time at sea, apparently so. ZR is the boost. Hang on a second. Of course, let's chit chat. Arg, I dropped it! Sploosh! A fat sack of precious coins right in the old drink. Where? Where's the money? Where's the money? Nah, we. Oh. Oh, this is, uh. This is gonna be. Mario, look! The streamer dips in the sea! How are we supposed to follow it down there? Okami intensifies. We're gonna head up to the Dragon Palace or something? <laughs> All right. This is worrisome. No, no, don't worry. We're just going under the sea and a... we're just made out of paper. What's the worst that water can do to us? All right, meanwhile, we haven't been here in a while. Let's see what's going on aboard the HMS Princess Peach, was it? Let's... All right. Oh, would you look at that? They got it all nice and fixed up. We need to rescue the passengers that abandoned the ship, but there's too much fog out on the Great Sea. If you see that the fog is lifted, will you come and let us know, please? Toot toot. That's good. Crew off the head. Crew entrance, no unauthorized entrance. All right, what do we got? We're almost ready to welcome our stranded passengers back aboard. I don't want to work on this cruise anymore. I want to enjoy it. I'm preparing food for our returning passengers. Abandoning ship must work up quite an appetite. Oh man, let's look at all this good food. All right, I am very curious. I don't think I got everything here, but let's just check. 95% uh, bottomless holes repaired. 67 collectible treasures. I think now's a good time to whip out... Nope, not that one. No, 
This boat is so huge and fancy. Traveling aboard of this beauty must make for some great memories. That wasn't the button. This is the button. All right, toad, lamination, hidden block gun hinder. Gun. Oh, hang on. Ah, there's nothing here. Let's undo that. Hang on, am I even finding hidden block? Whoops, that's not the right button. Uh, I've hit all the blocks. Collectible treasure is collected. All right. Somewhere around this place is a hole. <laughs> Not sure where it is, but, uh... Hang on, why did I just ignore that guy? <laughs> Must be so confused. Mario just pops in, looks around, and leaves. I fell asleep on the job and had a ter terrifying dream that I was born as a doormat. I know it was just a dream, so why does it feel like someone stomped all over my face? Yeah, no idea, buddy. Captain never lets me steer the ship. <laughs> Our captain really loves Princess Peach, and I am not talking about the ship. Buddy, don't make me whip out my hammer. Alright. Guess we'll talk with the crew, because I'm willing to bet if we can't do anything about uh, going down beneath the sea yet, we might have to do something about the fog. But also, oh yeah. The black ink is all gone. Whoever cleaned it didn't miss a single spot. That's good. Alright, and we're back out on deck. Oh, that's right. There was this little area back here. Funny. Music's actually pretty good. Oh, it won't let me jump in the pool. Aw. Alright, up on the top deck. Extra money. Nothing too crazy around here. I suppose all that's left to remain to be seen is down below deck. Also, a couple of doors, probably. Like this conference room here. Oh, wait, no, this is the conference room. This was the, uh,. Guest suite or whatever. Oh. Hello, what's this? Oh, just a full heal. Alright. This is the VIP stateroom. It's for VIPs only, so we've got to keep it tidy at all times. After saving this whole ship, you're the most VI of all peas, Mario. Feel free to use this room at your leisure. Alright. Where is this last hole? I said it was gonna, uh, well, before the stream really began, began, I said, I'm gonna wait just for a moment to do all the backtracking, but since I'm here and there's only one hole to find. Oh, no words, Olivia, about wanting to be an elevator person? Okay. What do you gotta say? The elevator goes straight to the VIP stateroom on the second floor. If you're not in the rush, you can stop by our lounge for refreshing fruit juice, or two, or three. Someone's got a drinking problem. Oh, there it is! There we go, we're good. <laughs> I can live without, there's probably like only one hidden collectible treasure and we'll be back for that sometime later. Shall we ship out? Yes. So, the streamer goes down into the ocean. Oh, but looky here. It comes back up. And, oh dear. Whoa, Avast! This fog is unbelievable! Can't see through it at all! We'd just get lost in that mess. Better turn back before we get ourselves in trouble. Oh no. Ah, what a pain in the port bow. Wish we had a sea chart. Then we could navigate through the haze. Say, speaking of sea charts, you two ever heard of the legend of the le uh, ever heard of the legend of the legendary Captain Ode? Legends speak of a legendary toad who moved beneath the waves and owned a legendary sea chart. Ah, but those are just tall tales. Not much truth behind them, I reckon. If only they were true, a sea chart like that might help us cut root through this blasted fog. Do you mean Captain T. Ode? We know that guy. He said he'd be at the musee. 
Ha 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 ha, you jokers. That might be the most ridiculous fib I've ever heard. He met a legendary captain from ancient times, and he's just hanging out in a dusty old museum. Ha. You serious? Well, what are we waiting for? Let's head straight for that museum. Can we get back out of the fog? Uh-oh. I was expecting there to be, like, a Silent Hill moment of something's moving in the fog. Oh, hello. This fog is incredible, eh? Can't move forward if you don't know which way you're going. I read that on a twist-off cap once. That bottle of juice was so wise. All right, let's explore the perimeter as much as we can. Lots of fog. Island. Snapple is. Yep, Snapple is very wise. It's like swimming around the air with sea and xenoblades. It's gonna take forever. Alright. We're at that edge of the map. Wow, there's a lot of water out here. I mean, it's the Great Sea. You would assume there'd be a lot of water. All right, before we head back to the museum, let me swing by over this direction. So there's the uh, Princess Peach over there. We got, oh, what up, buddy? There's an island in the sea where you can battle giants. It's true. If you're itching to fight some big old brutes, just head, just find the reef below here and head uh, left. I'm not sure which way is which. Those giants hit me pretty hard. Oh. So we go back to Tiny Big Island, huh? So down and to the left, was it? But there's a giant big old fog in our way. All right. My guess is that we need a sea chart in order to get anywhere. Unless... Wait. Wait, what is this? Ah, there's an island out here. We've passed by several, but sure, let's take a look. <laughs> yeah, I'm worried, Clueless. Hard enough to knock him over to that spot, indeed. Scuffle Island. Sure, I'm feeling reckless. What do we got? Island of Combat, Scuffle Island. Battles await beyond this gate. Uh oh. Welcome, Warrior of the Waves. This island is home to seven super powerful paper macho enemies. If you manage to defeat them, you shall be warded with coins, more and more with each victory. However, if your HP drops to zero, it will be game over. You'll lose the round and all your hard won coins. Use of mushrooms is forbidden. Consider your remaining HP carefully before continuing to the next round. Enough setup. The island demands combat. The first battle begins now. It's a blood sport. Oh no, a Goomba. Round one, stopping sentry. Paper, Macho Goomba. Ready? Fight! Oh, <laughs> this music. Yeah, three stickers. I know. What a... What a horrifically awful challenge this is, he said with some sarcasm. Come on, this way. And now he's vulnerable. Come on, this way, buddy. Smack. This way. Ole. And there we go. Okay. <laughs> you win. Paper mark, Joe Goomba. 100 coins. Prize total, 100 coins. Is it weird that anyone else had to make it vulnerable? You have to hit it on the butt. Yeah, it's just... Yeah. Uh, continue battling. Bow on. Good for money and confetti farming. Yeah, I wouldn't match it so. I'm willing to bet there's a max heart if I defeat all seven in a row. But uh, let's bow out for now because let's actually continue the story. <laughs> 
Are you sure you want to bow out now? Bow out. Very well, you may take your prize and depart. The island shall await your return. Hi, Toad. Um... You cleared one round and won 100 coins. If your warrior tummy rumbles once more, you may return here to satisfy your hunger for battle. Don't blink. Blink in... They are fast. Faster than you can believe. Don't even look away. Don't blink. <laughs> Alright. Let's uh, ship out. Yes. Man, that episode of Dr. Who was good. Toad is a weeping angel. That is horrifying to really think of. All right, let's return to town, because we need to head back to the museum. Seeing those things, hurry up. Gotta love that loading. Oh, I already read that one. The problem with having jump and read on the same button is that sometimes you will read when you want to jump. How's everybody over here? You doing all right? Where's Purple Toad? You're gonna have to be a bit more specific. There's a bunch of Purple Toads. <laughs> all right. I'm still curious if I open this up. There was a treasure chest up here I couldn't grab, right? Yeah, what up? He just saved me. I think he probably would have made me into a rug. Master Toad has returned from his travels with a wealth of new experiences to add to his wealth of... wealth. What do we have a seat? Not gonna sit down, huh? Alright. Chit-chat. Ah, Mario. Thanks again for helping with that nasty business back in Shroom City. I owe you one. Please feel free to pick these up at your leisure. Whoa! whoa! Holy smokes! As an additional sign of gratitude, I have unlocked all the doors of my fabulous manse. Holy smokes! That is a lot of money! You think there's a hidden block leading to the treasure? Oh. You know what? That is a good question. Uh, that wasn't quite the button I wanted to hit, but... Wait, accessories. Yep, raise your HP by a lot. Alright, hidden block gun hinder. Does not appear to be anything in this room. Alright. That was worth a shot. Because I can't quite make that jump. But he did say he unlocked all the doors. So maybe we just need to go in through the door that's uh, above and to the left. Yeah, we just need to get up to this door that's right up here. Alright, this is probably just a collectible. Oh. Well, that would have been handy. And we have the log cabin. Nice. Okay. Anything up here? Oh, it's just you. You want some confetti? 300 coins. Uh, no, we're good. Come back when F. Right, there was an accessory I believe I could buy, maybe. I don't think this is the accessory house. This is not the accessory house. Just gotta make sure that block stays there in case it thinks about moving. I love this music so much. Alright, that's the battle arena. There's the museum. That's our next objective. Let's stop by here and pick up some stuff. Because I'm pretty sure there's at least one new accessory. Wait, this is the weapon shop. Come to think of it, how many weapons do I have? Let's double check. Uh, weapons. I got a lot of iron boots. Holy smokes, I have so many boots. I got shiny iron boots. Pearl hammer, flashing hammer. Alright. I think I want to buy a couple extra hammers. 
What can I get you? Please spend generously. All right, not too generously. All right, hold up. Also, let me, thanks, come again. Let me just make sure, do I have the correct badge equipped? Uh, badge, yes I do, the silver membership badge. It's perfectly good. All right, there's the shiny hammer. Hurl hammer, and this one is the shiny hurl hammer. Hush hammer, I'll buy one of these. There we go, that'll do it. Come back soon and don't forget to equip that with plus. All right, accessory shop would be this way. Yeah. Forgive me, it's been literally a few weeks and after so much Splatfest. Hang on a second, did I? I'm sure I've already explored through this hole that I happen to notice. Yes, I have. Oh, but I don't think I've talked with you. Don't tell anyone about this place, okay? I'm growing organic kale, and it's like a magnet for hipsters. <laughs> All right, it was worth coming back to speak to him. Right, where is the accessory shop? It should be this one right here. Hey, buddy. Anything new? Fun, funky, and functional. You got accessories, you've got accessories. Gold, holy smokes. That is a lot of money. That is gonna wipe us out. <laughs> Gold time plus, your total is nine, 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 nine coins. Ready to buy? Yes. Gives you a ton of extra time to arrange enemies in battle. Hold. Thank you kindly. And that's it, we're sold out. Don't worry, we're restocking a bit. Oh, and don't forget to equip your accessories. Okay. Yeah, we're equipping that right now. So yeah, extra time, more time, a ton of extra time. That's the max one for that. Oh, I'm an idiot. If I was looking for treasure, I would need to put this on. Uh, good thing you got the treasure from the rich toad. Yeah, thanks for buying me extra time. Here's to the 1% in the mushroom kingdom because in real life, the 1% are terrible. Okie doke. Let's open this up. Huh? I thought Captain T. Ode would be here to greet us. Captain T. Ode? You mean Captain Talwood? He's. he's not real, you know. It's just all just an ancient legend. Quite colorful, to be sure, but imaginary. <laughs> hey, that sign says no piloting the Marino. You're in direct violation of the sign. Ah, my precious Marino. Still beautiful, still formidable, and yet time marches on. Hey, we were just talking about you. So, did you find the uh, thingy you were looking for? The sea chart. That's what it was called. Oh, I hope you have it. What is lost may never be found. All that remains is a shattered reflection, like a teardrop in a pond. Is, I'm sorry, is that a Tears in the Rain reference? <laughs> I... All these moments will be lost in time like Tears in... That, that is really, really Blade Runner. At least I think it's Blade Runner. But yes, I have a sea chart. Maybe... It, come on. I propose a trade. Convey me and my vessel to the Great Sea and you shall have my chart. Sorry I'm late, but I think I heard everything while I was running in. You wanted to get that rig to the Great Sea? I'm your toad. Oh, this is going to be so cool. A submarine on a boat? Two famous captains? I can't wait. What about my exhibit? It's the star attraction. I can't curate something else out of thin air. Buddy, have you seen the stuff I've been bringing in? <laughs> and, of course, the museum director just got completely and utterly screwed. Easy, keep her coming. Alrighty, you should be good to go here. You decide you want to rig up a few more out boots, give that vessel some real oomph, you call me. You have my gratitude. And you may now have this. We got the C chart. Yay, thank you so much. I can't wait to adventure on the sea. Who knows what kinds of amazing things we'll see. Um, Olivia? Olivia, we, we've already been out there. We had a small adventure with the paper macho Goomba, like, ten minutes ago. 
Whoa, has anyone ever rhymed those two words before? I'm, I'm sure they have, Olivia. <laughs> I must say, this whole situation with Captain T.O. Wood being real is what in the museum business call completely bananas. <laughs> That said, there's no disputing the ancient text. The merino is yours, Captain. I wish you good luck and toad speed. And if you should choose to return to my humble museum at any time in the future, I will gladly offer you a personal tour. Farewell. Well, this is going to be super. I'm just so excited that you have all called on me and my boat to help. And I can't wait to see what that submarine can do. Going under the water? What do they think of next? I assume over the water, which is just flying. Anyway, I'm ready when you are. Alright. Actually, let's speak to Captain Tiawe first. A voyage of a thousand fathoms begins with the flooding of a single ballast tank. Great words of wisdom. Shall we set motor for the great sea? Yes. All right, first let's see where the streamer submerges, and then I'm pretty sure from that point it will lead forward to where it rises up back into the fog. We have the C chart for that. Press L to view my C chart. All right, the red boat marks your current position. Check my C chart as you go to keep from getting lost. It's mostly blank right now, but I'll add any new islands we discover along the way. I've already mapped one island on the sea. Menacing, skull-shaped. I named it Bonehead Island. Bonehead Island is said to hide a secret tied to the fog surrounding the Great Sea. Let's start there. Yeah, sure, go to the most dangerous spot. Press down to dive in the submarine. If you dive in a suspicious spot, there's no telling what you'll find. Set a course for Bonehead Island. Make it thusly. Yay, ben Bonehead Island, here we come. All right, so we are the... I, hang on, let me see. So it goes Rook, then Knight, then Bishop. I believe we are... Uh, let's see, Queen on Color. So hang on. I'm looking at this like a chessboard, except we're missing one. That wouldn't work. <laughs> we're missing... Uh, this is a 7x7 seven seven rather than an 8x8, eight eight, so we're playing like mini chess, which would be interesting. A chess game without a queen, that, ooh, ooh, ooh. You know, I would be interested. But nonetheless. <laughs> hey, Bonehead Island, here we come. No, we're not, Olivia. We're first going over here. That's a lot of bloopers. That is a lot of bloopers. So, Captain Tioe. Oh, man. Oh, forgive me, I'm kind of yawning. All right. A square island. Curious, what mysteries await us there, I wonder. We're just gonna... Plot that down right there. Perfect. But we're not actually gonna go there. Swim around. Bonehead Island. Oh, they want you to go visit my family. Rhea, I thought that was my family. Oh, don't worry. My, I love my family. They put the fun and dysfunctional. Alright. So, Island in the Sea, we can battle giants. It's true. Head of the left... I'm not sure which way is. The Giants are pretty hard. All right. Oh, wait. Hang on a second. There was money that was... Doo -doo 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 -doo. One of the islands had a shy guy on it. Ah, here it is. All right, I dropped a sploosh. A fat sack of precious coins right in the old drink. Looks like there's something here. Shall we investigate further? All right. How does this work? Oh. Ooh, the Great Sea is so pretty. Oh, no. Motion controls. Tilt that to examine your surroundings. All right. Uh. All right. So we have a limited field of view. Ah. There's something here. Press X to extend the arms. Uh, should be this button. Tilt that to move the arm. Grab. Yay. Excellent. Let's return to the surface. How much monies? Because we got like, what, 10 grand from the rich dude? Heavy bag! Shy Guy's precious keepsake, lost at sea. Let's try to return it. It's 
A bag? Looks like it belongs to someone. Better not peek. But, but, but money! Money! <laughs> you might be able to find yet more unknown treasures. Try driving into suspicious stretches of water. <sighs> Fine, we'll do the right thing. Fast second, yep. Hair. <gasps> My wallet! That's your wallet? Wait, I probably shouldn't say that. We carried around, like, how many tons of gold on us? If we stop to think, like, how much a gold piece is worth. But then again, it's made of cardboard in this. Whatever, whatever. You found it and didn't keep it? Amazing. Please take this reward for being so trustworthy. Okay, we got a grand from that. I'll never let this huge sack of coins out of my sight ever again. He's going to let that giant sack of coins out of his sight again. Isn't he? All right. So, obviously, we need to dive here for something. As much as I want to go, oh, oh man, forgive my yawning. It's just been a long day. All right, what have we got? Hey, the streamer is stuck in the sand down there. You can't follow it like this. All right, doesn't matter. Mario's pockets would be uncomfortably padded with heavy coinage. Right. So we already know where that is going to go up. Need somewhere to the north. Let me see. Captain Teoid. Anything over here? Let's take a look at this C chart. Ah, yes. We are currently at uh, 6F. Anything down here? Ah, fortune smiles on us. A whole 10 coins. All right. Somewhere over in... Ooh. All right. Uh... I don't know if we can actually get to this island. Oh, what do you got to say? This fog is incredible. Can't move forward if you don't know which way you're going. I'm twist it. Yep, all right. Well, it's this way. Ah, fog! Fear not, my sea chart shall guide us. All right, we're doing good. Yep. We're going through the fog like this. Checking the map. All right, we're heading straight forward. Uh, does anyone know where the brakes are on this thing? Oh, never mind. We're good. Whoa, a creepy skull. Okay, Dr. Wily. I understand that Mega Man hasn't been as popular nowadays, but come on. Oh, boy. Ooh, sure is creepy. Is it just me, or is that big, ugly skull face staring at us? Don't surrender to fear. You must explore this island. Secrets await, and I want to hear what they are. Well, I can tell by looking that there's already another weeping toad. That's, like, in the nose of that skull there. So, uh, we might be in a bit of a pickle here. Oh, goodness. An island full of... No. No, 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 no. They've probably already done that on Doctor Who. Of course the creepy music would set in. Alright, these crows, they're gonna seal my hat, aren't they? Oh. Let's take care of this. There we go. Fixing up a creepy island. What could possibly go wrong? Looks like this go. Oh. All right, first battle. Smack! That was a lot of toads in the background. All right, let's see if I even remember how to do all this. You got 50 seconds to line them up and three moves. So that's going to be. Uh, hang on. Let's do it. Take a look from above. One, and then two, and then. Alright, let's hit him with the flashy boots. Actually, no, wait. Uh, mm, sure, flashy boots first. Got a bonus. There we go. Give me the coins. Give me the confetti. Alright. And now I'm going to go back here because... 
At this point, I don't think shiny boots are really going to be worth it. <laughs> we got two flashy boots. Yeah, we're at the point in the game where I think a lot of crazy stuff is going to start happening in terms of damage. All right. Come on, little more confetti. There we go. Fun, funky, and functional. I have accessories for sale. They are good. This is the entirety of my sales pitch. Holy smokes! Walk 10,000 steps with this and you'll be rewarded. That is so much money. That is so much money. Is that even worth it? Because <laughs> you'd have to spend 14,000 and then keep it equipped for 10,000 steps and be rewarded with something. See you again soon, probably. I mean, I, mm, I don't know if that's going to be like a max heart thing, which in that case, yeah, it's going to be worth it. Or, oh, I didn't, I didn't mean to hit that twice. But nonetheless, we are here. All right, so we need to save up 1400 for that. Ooh. I've got a little block over here. Excuse me. Thank you. All the blocks hit on Bonehead Island. And look what we have here. Cafe. It's a cafe. All right, let's, uh, I've got enough for a coffee. Right around. Welcome. Come on in. Of course, Bonehead Island would just be full of <laughs> two dry bones and a dry Goomba, I think it is. Da, da, da. Get up. Wake up. Wake up. Rattle, rattle. Welcome to the Bone Dry Cafe. What's your order? I'll have a Morbid Mocha for 100 coins. What problem is, Mario? You know, like Spoon. Uh, it's, it's a bone. <laughs> you want to borrow mine? Coffee here, big tasty. Please don't. Sir, please don't chew on our spoons. Other people need them. Rattle, 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 rattle. Hey, is that other dry bones okay? He's been collapsed for an hour. Uh, the coffee I made him must be ice cold by now. Hey, cut him break, pal. Him up all night prowling. He big, big exhausted. The night shift? That's rough. Oof, been there. Let him rest. I'll pour him a fresh cup when he wakes. And there's your cafe scene for the recording session. <laughs> Very accommodating. All right. All right, well, let's go into the skull. Uh-oh. Um. Huh. Not sure if puzzle or just oddly shaped atmosphere. Okay. Phew, we can smack Boombas. All right. Th there's something here, right? There is clearly something in this room that's going to be a puzzle later. Let's go here. Uh, what? Huh. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. This looks like the job for one of my abilities. Hang on. Uh, items. Hidden block on hider. Let's see if there's anything in here. Not in this direction. Wait, I already got all the hidden blocks. Right, yeah. So let's do toad radar. Except we have it. Huh. Weird. Now that we've explored one year, it'd be crazy for us not to go on to the other one, right? Okay. That wasn't quite the button I meant to hit, but. <laughs> oh, hop up here. Aha. Uh -huh. Got my eye on you, toad. So we head up this direction. Oh, there's a toad around here. Hey, buddy. Get up. 
You saved me! As thanks, let me show you where to find a sunken treasure. I'd claim it, but I'm lazy. Sunken treasure. Zoop. Right about there. Close the sea chart. Yeah, thanks, Olivia. I hate hitting the wrong button sometimes. All the toads rescued. Is that everything? I don't think that's everything. Alright, what? Ow! Ow! That was not what I meant to do. Ah. Puzzle. Uh-oh. And a fight. Ooh, we got some Angie boys. All right, one and then two. All right, we're gonna hit these guys with flashy boots. These are gonna break eventually. Wait till just take care of that. All right, we're gonna hit these guys with flashy hammer. Boom. Six hundred and thirty two extra coins. There we go. All right, th this should be the okay. Huh. All right, clearly there's a puzzle here. So I can manipulate the ones on that side. Can't manipulate these. So what if I mirror it instead? Let's try that. So down, then up. Uh, I assume that's the right answer because I literally couldn't control anything. There we go. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. <laughs> it, oh boy. Oh boy. Uh, I got a bad feeling about this. Let's do it. So let me get, let me get this straight. Those two, nice and easy puzzle that leads to death. Yep, that's exactly it, Rhea. But let me get this straight. I solve one puzzle to open the switch that will then open the door. Why not just have these two open the door? I mean, I'm not going to, you know, talk too much trash about whoever designed the, uh, in-game, whoever designed this cave probably could have just skipped this step entirely. That's just me. As of the video game designers, no, I'm not calling them out. But it just seems a little weird that... Why would... You open a switch... Okay. Hmm. 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 Video game logic, yeah. Alright. This is the part where I think it's a trap. Let's do it! We got Submarine Marino. All treasure collected. I think that means I'm completely done with Bonehead Island. Isn't that? Yay, 100%. Hurrah. We're also complete. Well, no, we're not. We're done, done with Scuffle Island, but there's nothing to collect there. So, all right. That's good to know. Yeah, it's a short little island. I mean, <laughs> guess that means we're not going to be spending too much time here. Hi. Whoa! Oh, you've got to be kidding me. All right. Uh. Back to the top. I fully expect it was a Mario-style mimic. Does the Paper Mario series ever use mimics? Oh. <laughs> I would not put it past the designers to make a mimic in the Paper Mario universe. But I don't think that's a thing here. All right. So from here... Can I jump... There we go. Hi. Um. If you seek paradise, gather the three orbs on Diamond Island. Pair of dice? What in the world is this statue talking about? Uh-oh. Is this a load-bearing island? Wait a minute. What is this? Sticker star?
Wow, the fog totally vanished. That was amazing. Seek and ye shall find. Come, follow me to paradise. Yeah, when I when a statue tells me I should follow it to paradise, I do not want to follow it to paradise. Ooh, this sounds like fun. Olivia. Olivia. <laughs> but, well, I guess we need to deal with the purple streamer first. Alright, so does that mean we don't we can't take care of this until after we take care of the purple streamer? Question mark? Or maybe we take care of it on the way to the Oh look, it's Mario's biggest fan. Rhea! <laughs> oh the puns. Alright. Shall we ship out? Yes. Hmm. So what to do at this point? There are three orbs to collect and bring it close to Diamond Island. Yes, that awful fog is finally gone. Now we can explore the rest of the big ol' ocean. Ah, there's the streamer over there. Let's follow it, Mario. Ooh, new oh, hold up. We got an alert. What do we got? A new engine for your boat has been completed and is now available at the Toad Town Dock. Oh heck yeah, we're getting a new engine. Return to town. Welcome to the Toad Automobile Boats. This latest boat engine we've got going is no joke. It's twice as fast, ten times as fun, and a million times more dangerous. Just how you like it, am I right? Now that I can swap it out for you for five, wow, um, ah, uh, shucks, you got a need for speed and a need for coins. Come back when you get more, okay? Yeah, we're going to need 5,000 coins. Uh, we're only at 4,000. I am going to need to grind for a little bit. Where's a good place to grind? Oh, hang on. Wait, wait. It's here. Finally. All the coin blocks hit. Okay. This. There we go. Is there anything else in Toe Town? Let me just check. <laughs> Map. Oh, we. Oh, there are so many collectible treasures that are missing. Do, do. Coin. Yeah, I want coin. Okay, we're just collecting confetti now. Oh, there's some coin. All right, we got 700 more to go. But I could have sworn I had a whole delivery of mushrooms and snacks in here. Those darn folded soldiers must have gotten to him. Yep, that's totally what happened. Hop up here, hop up here. All right. Oof. Okie doke. I'm trying to think, maybe instead of just running around here, we could always just head over to an area that has a lot of coins on it. I wonder, you know what? I doubt it's gonna work. Let's talk to the rich guy again. There's no way this is gonna work, right? At all. No one in there. No one in there. Man, Mario makes a terrible death by daylight villain, doesn't he? Oh, and he's gone. Uh, where'd he go? Master Toad has returned from his travels with wealth. Blah, 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 blah. All right, where, where'd he go? Huh. I'll take that coin. Excuse me, where did he go? Oh, there he is. What up? Oh, hello again, Mario. It seems I'm once again in your jet. You rescued my loyal employee. Now that allow me to offer you a good deal of confetti, it's the least I can do. You have confetti with... Oh, really? 99% of the confetti supply? Oh, no. Ah, uh, yeah. That's my boss. <laughs> Alright. Well, now we know where he is. But we need to get some cash. Pretty much the best way to do that is... Oh, hang on. Wait, 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 wait. Don't we have, like, a hidden treasure chest that's out in the open ocean we can dig up? That's got to be worth a couple hundred, right? 
Yeah, it probably is. All right. Let's head back to that way. All right. Shall we set motive for the Great Sea? Yes. And we can skip this cutscene. So, where was that buried treasure? Let's hope it's at least worth 700 gold. Or we can always scuffle. Ooh, all right. All right, we need to move a knight's direction this way. I love that ocean music, right? They really kicked it up a notch. All right, it is coming up to it. Oh, there's the streamer again. It is going to be this way. Oh, we got some bloopers over there. Oh, joy. What is this? All right, pretty close. Should be in this awfully suspicious circle of stuff. All right. Turn around. Turn around. Turn right in the center. There we go. Let's see what we get. Oh, money. Where are you, money? Money! Money! Yeah. Extend the arms. Should we turn the surface? No. Where's that darn button? There's the button. Grab! Yank! Excellent! Let's return to the surface. Please be a lot of money. Please be a lot of money. It's Paper Macho Mummy Goomba. Yay! This is not what I wanted. I wanted money. Uh, nonetheless, I should probably oh, follow the streamer. Oop. Oh, hello. That's definitely a mushroom. Only one choice here, Mushroom Island. All right, this is... Come on. Let's set sail for Mushroom Island. Oh. I, uh, I don't think. <laughs> oh my gosh, this whole house is encased in a block of ice. Hope the people inside are okay. Well, this isn't the most suspicious toad ever. Get up. <gasps> Finally, after days and days of swimming, I made it to this island. My friend and I promised to meet here in the case of a huge disaster. I wonder where they are. Oh, buddy, I got bad news for you. <laughs> All right. And more confetti. Oh, man. We... This ain't going to do much. We're going to need fire elemental stuff. Maybe. There we go. All right. Do your thing, girl. Oh, yeah. I gotta watch these at least once per recording session. They're super long cutscenes, you know, when repeatedly viewed. But it's so cool to see a transformation sequence, right? It's why some guys watch Sailor Moon obsessively. Yep, for the transformation sequences. <laughs> All right, try not to burn down the house, please. There we go. So, uh, you want to come inside or what? Okay, hang on. My toad ring, toad thing. 
Come on. As soon as I got close to him. Oh, it has amazing control of its fire. Oh, all right. <laughs> yeah, sorry about that, Rhea. Apparently, the, uh, the your Ho-Oh has amazing control of its fire. Apparently, it saw that first part of the uh, Pokemon's name as a terrible thing. I might want to nerf that. Doesn't it look doesn't look like anyone is home. This is clearly somebody's house. Where do you think they could be hiding on such an island? Such a tiny island. Come on up. Wake up. Wake up. Where are you? Fine, let's take a look at this big door back here. This door is missing something. I can't quite my can't quite put my finger on it. Or any part of my hand for that matter. There's no way to open it. Do we have a spare handle nearby? Oh, you mean this? That's creative, but definitely not what this door needs. So we're looking for a doorknob. Uh, sweet key, professor room. We got those. Worldly pass. All right. Well, it looks like we need to return here when we have a doorknob. Wherever we can find a doorknob. But yeah. <laughs> Nonetheless, we have parts of our objective, and I think that is going to do it. For the VOD. <laughs> so yeah, we can go on for about an hour. That's a good time to cut it off. So if you've been watching on YouTube, thank you so much for joining me. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And follow me on Twitter so long as that website exists. I will keep posting updates from when I stream and scheduling updates and whatever. And until next time, YouTube, uh, take care.